Happy New Year! Woo! -hoo. Yeah, that's the excitement. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so yeah, Happy New Year! It is now 2013. I remember thinking when it was gonna be 2000, how that seems so far away and so like magical and awesome. That was 13 years ago, and now I just kind of feel old. <laughs> but yeah, it's a new year. 2012 was good and bad. I wouldn't say it was great. I wouldn't say it was horrible either. There was ups and downs. But I have a feeling 2013 is going to be a good one. And I've decided to try a little vlogging. We'll see how this goes. Hmm. I wouldn't say I have New Year's resolutions. It's pretty much just the same as what I always do. Try and stay positive keep positive people in my life, get rid of the negative people. I just, as I'm getting older, God, <laughs> why do I make it sound like I'm going to be 40? Not 40. Not yet. 11 years. Do some math. Um, but as I've, you know, grown up, I, I don't worry what people think, and I don't worry about having a lot of people in my life. I'd rather just have a few good people that I can count on so keep the negative out. You just you got to get to a point where you just don't have time for that and move on and make that break and get on with yourself. So that's pretty much my biggest. But let me go get my day started and I'll try and record a little on my iPhone because I don't have a fancy camera. But yeah, so let's try vlogging. That'll be another New Year's resolution. You can say it's that. Because I love... I I am not a huge YouTube person. Like, I, I... There are people I watch on YouTube, and when I find someone I love, I watch everything they have. If they vlog every day, like, that becomes part of my daily routine. So I kind of, like, want to give it a try. Gotta get used to sitting here talking to myself. <laughs> but, yeah. Um, I'm gonna give it a go. I need to fix my hair. Don't know what's going on. So, I just got done with World Market. I didn't record anything while I was in there because it was, it was very weird in there. Like, I think it's because they have furniture on sale, but there's a lot of open spaces and it was very quiet. So, I decided not to. But, I got some stuff. No mince pea pies. Apparently, they were on special and so they're gone. But there is a British store in town, and hopefully they have them, but I really don't like going there. They have horrible customer service. Horrible. But let me show you what I got. Let's see. Turn. I don't know how to turn it around. Heinz baked beans. The best baked beans ever. And then I got milk chocolate digestives. Ooh, the sun's kind of weird. Sorry about that. Um... Let's see. And I got some arrow bars. Regular. I got a mint for my mom. Regular digestives. And then this is a two in one. It's milk and white chocolate. That sounds good. I love white chocolate. Even though I don't think it's technically really chocolate. Oh, and a bounty bar! Which I don't like at all because I don't like coconut. But my mom likes them. So pretty much everything I got was for her, and which because I told her I was coming here before I left the house. Left the house, but they had no like chocolate candies, like Christmassy. Because I guess everything went on sale. I should have gone sooner. I don't know why I waited so long. Kind of sad. But I'm gonna go to Target because I have to get a couple things. So we'll talk to you in a little bit. So, I'm at Target, wandering around, seeing if there's anything on clearance that I want. <sighs> I got my moisturizer, and then I had a sports bra. It's bright ass pink, but it's 10 bucks, and it's supposed to be high support. But I don't understand why there's padding in it. So, yeah, but it's $10, <clears throat> and it's worth it. So I'll give it a go, see how it is. I'll just try it on at home and go from there. But I need to get a toothbrush. Some other stuff. Hello! So this is probably it for me. For my first day. Um, let's see. 
I ended up going to this place called It's. It's like an arcade and restaurant for like families. And they make you buy the buffet. Granted, it's only $5, so it's not horrible, but the food sucked. So I had really crappy pizza and curly fries for dinner. And I guess the only positive to that is it was so bad that I didn't eat much. And so I came home and made guacamole and had guacamole and chips for a snack, and now I'm full. But, oh, that was awkward. Um... A limerita. I don't know. I didn't realize when I bought these yesterday, before I went over to my friends, that they were only eight ounces. Like, look how small that is. Grant, I do have a big head, but this is really small. And normally, we get the tall cans. Ooh, there's fighting. I should pause that. Hold on. Yeah. So normally we end up with like tall, like. I don't know if they're technically tall cans, but they're bigger than average cans of the Lime Marita. But for this reason, I thought I was getting just regular size cans. No, they're teeny tiny. And I really, I'm not even quite sure what this is. I think it's like a margarita and Bud Light Lime mixed, right? I could be wrong. But it's, it's delicious. It's refreshing. And it's not super duper sweet. First day is over. I think it's like nine-ish. Not even, maybe. Let me check. It's quarter to nine. <laughs> and I'm done for the day. I ain't doing anything else. I'm in pajamas, comfy clothes. I got my blanket and my pillows and my movie going. So I'll probably watch this. Um, I keep a journal. And I'll probably write in that because it's the first of the year and do a little reflecting and have a moment. But I just want to say good night.